Hello Bamboo Studio users, X1C and P1P fans. Bed syncing has finally come to Bamboo Studio and I'm here to show you how to use it. Let's say you want to print only this top section of your model because you just need to run some experiments with some settings to see how it prints and how those settings affect this portion of the model. In the past, taking the model and sinking it below the bed would spring it back to zero. However, with other slicers such as Cura, you can sink the model below the bed and have it stay there so that you can print only this section for testing. Now, with the latest public beta of Bamboo Studio version 1.6.0, you can take your model and sink it into the bed. And rather than spring back up to zero, it will stay there. This now allows you to print only the section above the bed, which comes in really handy for test printing certain difficult sections of the bed. I'm sure many of you can find other uses for this as well. Go ahead and slice the model. And you will see it has only sliced the section of the model above the print bed. Now I can run tests to see how much support I really need at the dome of this mask. Or do the horns need support or can I print them without support? Running tests like this can save you many hours of test printing. And over time with a large model or complex model that you print often, it can save you loads of filament by letting you test extreme conditions with minimal supports to find out just how far you can push things. Rather than having to print a gigantic mask, building up all of these supports just to find out if you can get away with less or none. So when you are working with your models and you are testing out complex areas and you're just not sure whether or not, for example, this section of the eyes needs support. Now you can grab the model, sink it below the bed, slice it, then run your test print immediately printing towards this eye section to find out if your support settings work. You could even go ahead and run a test print with no supports to find out what happens without having to print the entire mask first. This is an absolutely priceless feature that is long overdue and should be a very beneficial part of your printing process. Let me know how you utilize bed syncing in your projects to save yourself time, material, and stress in the comments below.